New Zealand. Everything is set. Referee Andrew Lee signals to go, and the action begins. Remember, it's 10 minutes each way for the final. It's the only game at any IRB 7s World Series event where they go beyond seven minutes each. 15 metres out. Trying to get into the game. Tomasi Thama, so much a vital part of the New Zealand effort. Forbes to Mickelson. To Sabe to Kula. There was a gap there. Couldn't quite drive it through, but he gets it off. Once again, it's Baker. Baker is on a roll here. Four tries in that semi final against V. Ola Louis up the middle. The captain Pessimino is waiting out wide. But they come in with Fadua Otto at first and the pick up of the loose ball. And once more it's Kurt Baker. And Baker's away. What a roll it is. Baker scores two in the space of just less than three minutes. And that grin gets ever wider. Tomasi Sama. Now, big power out here for the big young man who loves the handoff. And there it is again from Sabe Takula. Sabe de Kula, the youngster who's come in and really made his mark, but the breakdown, and now Pesamino for the first time against Zah Lawrence, Pesamino steps inside, he's pulled a hamstring, I'm pretty sure he has, it could be critical, in goes Simaika Mikhaili, and Pesamino is down, you could see him pull up like a sprinter in a 100 metre final, and he was about to go on the outside, they got the try in the end from the wonderful support of Simaika Mikhaili, but there's a big price to pay here, because here is the star of the Samoan side this season. Six on the field, but so too to Samoa. Back for no, Rock! Rock! It's a new version of the game. Six aside. Rock for hands off. There's already a Back tournament called the Hong Kong Sixers, and that's a cricket event. All right, play on. Oh! The referee just confirming the try is given. Great follow up. This game is so much about support play. It looked as though Fao Saliba was going to drive it in, and that really has opened it all up at the half. I expect to the Samoans. Like 10 out of 22 as uh, uh, Lola Louis goes again. Big handoff. This is what they like the close quarter, fast offloads into Ali Mai. Fatu Otto, Pesamino out wide, is his hamstring okay, his muscles are fine, his pace is still there, and that's the lead for Samoa for the first time. My word, they'll be so grateful that that was no more than a touch of crap that stopped him in his tracks earlier, because he is there with his 46th try of the season, and this is a crucial moment for Samoa. We've got to point out too that whichever team wins will go into the lead, on the IRB Tour, the World Series table, New Zealand at the moment lead by two points. But if Samoa win, they'll get the lead off. Someone needs to spark. Someone needs to reach down, as DJ well, Forbes well. himself says, dig deep. Fall you off your feet, don't use your hands. Now, breaking out. Gone, and it's Samoa on the break with Trevor Anders here. New Zealand slow to cover. There are two men back. Samoa's 22, but there's one deep in the New Zealand 22, and it's Mikhaili Pesamino. These players are out on their feet. I can tell you, I've never seen a final like this, and clearly it's been ultra grueling. And how crucial is that score with Samoa now stretching two scores ahead? And it's certainly the man who has sparkled throughout this season, who has perhaps put the nail in the coffin of New Zealand, and they're stretched out all over the paddock here. Some didn't even bother to chase, and that is so out of character. And Pesamino could coast home in the end and increase that lead to at least two scores ahead right of up. New Zealand. They are, this is them strutting their stuff on the world sporting scene. Little Samoa, these beautiful people, and here's New Zealand trying to do something to get something going, but it's another high bounce, turn it away, and the night is going to be long to Samoa, you can see that in absolute delight. There'll be tears of joy here for what this team has achieved and what has been achieved for that country. What a fantastic time this is for them. Well, sheer ecstasy for the men from Samoa, all Samoan-based players.
It's been a grueling contest. Credit to both sides, but my word, what a battle it has been. Wait! But am I only Lalo Milo, the manager, Stephen Beatham, the coach, the other members of the squad? We've had a dramatic final. New Zealand scored 14 points, and then the Samoans scored 24 unanswered. Pesamina might have the last say. No, it's Arnold going to have the last say. Under the sticks he goes. Is there any time left? We'll look to the referee.